Just about 8.17, so from new board games to mm -hmm. the classics you played as kids, you can now enjoy them all in one place. Hey, Good Day Columbus reporter Ashley, yours live at Kingmakers. It's a board game parlor in Short North. Hey, Ashley. <laughs> Hey, good morning, guys. So, all right, you both know me pretty well. Mm -hmm. I'm kind of oddly competitive about things <laughs> that really don't matter. Yeah. And so I think that this is the perfect spot for me because look at this. It's a whole wall of things that I can win, and it doesn't really matter if I win or not, does yeah. it, Sherm? Nope. It's all about the journey. It's all about playing with your friends, having a really good time, uh, getting to interact, uh, doing something out and about in Columbus uh, that's sort of special and unique. So this is really cool, and tell me a little bit about, I mean, this is not just Monopoly mm -hmm. or Candyland. I mm -hmm. mean, you would have those if you wanted to play them, but, I mean, what's on this wall? How many board games are there? Well, yeah, I'm so excited to say we have over 400 now. We 400? 400, yeah. <laughs> um, we had it 250 when we started. Um, now we're over 400, and what's really fun about it is there are, we do have Candyland and Monopoly, but we also have... Puerto Rico, Catan, a lot of people have heard of that one. Um, we've got all just all kinds of things, timeline, snake oil, lots of fun things. All right, so I come in here, I have no idea what game I want to play because I haven't heard of most of these. Mm -hmm. You have someone to help us out. Definitely, and that's what we're really excited about is people getting to come in and try new games and willing to like take that jump, take that adventure with us. And all of our guys here know a lot of different games, so they're able to recommend something that they really like, and then hopefully it's going to be something that you really enjoy, too. The game Sommeliers. I love that name. <laughs> That's so awesome. All right, so one that we were looking at over here. Tell me a little bit about this game, and let's pull it out and okay. see how Carolyn and Pete do, because I would like to know if they can if they can do it. All right, here, so let's get the top off. This so is Ashley, fact do they or serve, crap. Um, do they serve um, cocktails at this place? Our, um, party game? So. They have beer and wine, Carolyn, okay. so you can come out here. They also have coffee. You can hang out for as long as you want to, which is really cool, too. It's five bucks to just sit down and play. And... I want to know if, Carolyn, when you come out here, if you would be able to play this game. So here, I'm going to read you one uh -oh. line, oh, okay. and you here tell me what you guys think. Is this fact or crap? Okay. Dolphins sleep with one eye open. What do you think? Ooh, dolphins? Mm-hmm. That's fact. What do you think? Carolyn? I can make the sound of a dolphin, but I don't know the answer. Well, why don't you make the sound of the dolphin okay. while I read the answer? Okay, ready? One, two, three. Yeah, that, that is a fact, and that is really impressive. I can't believe that you can do that or that you just wow. did it on command. Do so I get extra points kudos. for that? I do a different one, though. I'm going to know which <laughs> one is so better. Many extra points. <laughs> wow. All right. All right, thanks, Well, guys, Ash. we're playing more games coming up. Yeah. Thanks, Ashley. We're playing our own game. It's called making dolphin noises. Hey, so here's a new way to enjoy an old pastime. I mean, we both, we love board games. I lo you know what? Last night I played three games of Uno. Really? Before bedtime. Mm -hmm. Nice. You have to play three to see who wins. Yeah, yeah. you got to have like best of three. Yeah. I gotcha. Good day, Columbus reporter Ashley Yor is playing board games at Kingmakers in the Shore North. And Ashley, I walked by this yesterday. I thought, I need to go. It's a must-see. You do, and you need to come with me. And guess what? This is going to make it even more tempting. The newest thing here at Kingmakers is... <laughs> Rampage. Is that what you Happy Hour? <laughs> well, yes, there's Rampage, so, which we're getting to. But there's a now Happy Hour. That just started last week. What are you trying to say, Ashley? To seven. Well, I'm just... Oh, just the information, you know Carolyn. Me very well. You know me very well. That's true. <laughs> they have I, coffee. I was excited about that. It sounded really cool. So it makes it an even better deal to come play awesome games like this one. Malika, tell me a little bit about this one. You said it's a newer game? Yeah, sorry. I was so excited about Rampage. You got right into it. How could you not be? I mean, look at this setup. It's real intense. Yeah, it's definitely one of the newer uh, games in our collection. It's very popular. So the whole idea is you're tearing through a city and causing as much destruction as possible and eating as many... Uh, citizens as possible. Well, destruction. All right, I'm in. So what do I need to know? Okay. So you move your little guy by flicking his base here, and then you can move him that many spaces. You can also drop him on buildings, causing them all to crash down, and collect folks that way that you're eating. Or uh, if you're in the vicinity of a bus, you can also put that bus on top of your piece and hurl that bus at various buildings. And I do want to point out, I have some power, secret superpower <laughs> and character here. So look at this. This is my secret superpower. I'm unleashed. <laughs> and you know what that means? Does that mean I can like throw this at a building? Yes, you can do, yes, you can pretty much do anything. 
thing. <laughs> that was really fun. <laughs> Even if that's all I get to do. Um, very cool. All right. This is awesome. And coming up, guess what? I'm going to move over to that table and show you two other games that I've also never heard of and never played. So keep your fingers crossed for me. This is no Uno, Carolyn. I'm really... Uh, Getting into it with some new games here. I just I got nervous when she drew the card and she drew the card and said that it's Ashley Unleashed. So Ashley <laughs> Unleashed. New segment Unleashed for you. Unleashed and Rampage. Yeah, yeah right. exactly. Thanks, I Ashley. love that. That sounds great. Well, everyone has a favorite board game. What, What's what, yours? Yeah, I was just gonna ask you. Remember playing Payday? That was fun. Because Monopoly took so long yeah. that we ended up playing Payday. I like the game of easier. life too. You life was that? good. Yes. I liked it then, uh, not so much now. Yes. <laughs> Not so much now. <laughs> well, there's game. one place where you are sure to have your favorite game. This morning, Ashley, yours in the midst of 400 different games. She's at Kingmakers in the short north. Hi, Ashley. Hey, good morning, guys. You are in luck because you don't just have to stick to the game of life or Monopoly. We have some games. I mean, I've never heard of them, so I'm going to guess you haven't heard of them either. Pretty cool. I'm hanging out with Sherm, and, you know, we're just a couple of gals playing some games. And what's that one? Uh, this is Grabwell. Uh, this is one of our newer games donated by the creator himself, uh, Corey Young. Super fun. Uh, it looks a little intimidating at first, but basically you're just playing cards. Really simple, but you're trying to escape the singularity that you've been sucked into. I don't even know what that means. Okay. <laughs> but you said he's also local, which is really cool. Yeah. Yep. Yeah, he's from Ohio. Uh, really great guy, up and coming. He's got a lot of great stuff out there. Awesome. All right. I want to let people know how they can find you because you're mm -hmm. a little bit tucked away, but still in the short north. Yeah, definitely. It's a, a little uh, hidden treasure, uh, as we like to think of it. Uh, 17 Buttles. It's right off of High Street. Um, and once you uh, find the door, you actually have to come downstairs too. We're in the basement, so definitely tucked away, a little hidden, but don't be afraid. Come on down, cross that threshold. Once you get in it, I know you're gonna love it. And five dollars, you can play as many games as you want, and you don't even have to leave because there's snacks and drinks. Yeah, so we um, have two local snacks. Uh, we have Crema Nut Company and then Rogue Bakery, both great companies, uh, love working with them. Uh, we've got fun uh, specialty sodas. We've just got this new happy hour. It's gonna be Thursday, um, Tuesday, and Wednesday. Um, basically, it's a dollar off domestic cans and $2 off draft. All right, awesome. Now, another one of the games that you can play, what's this one? Timeline, oh, this is one of our favorites. Uh, it's a great game to kind of kick off the night and get started with. Basically, you're just creating a timeline with the rest of your group, but you're kind of working against them to get rid of your cards the quickest. All right, so I got a guess. All right, guys, do you know when Ghostbusters was? Oh. Do you have a guess? Was that 78, 77? Where, where would this fit was, in the uh, timeline? Like Let me look early here. 80s. Oh, maybe. I'm going to put it right here. Maybe it's and now you can flip it over. Sherm, tell me, am I right? Drum roll, please. Woo, you're right. Yeah. Yay. And I, I will admit this just because you guys would probably figure me out anyway. Uh, it's written on the back of the card. Oh, so I may have peaked. Never, never playing never games a cheater. with you. I'm not a cheater. Uh -huh. I just like to win. So. <laughs> a long shot here. He Ask Sherman if she has a game called Breaker Breaker 1-9. Do you have a game called Breaker Breaker 1-9? No, but I will look into it. We're always looking for new suggestions, so. Marshall, that you gotta come a, out. That was a board game when I was a kid when CB radios were all the rage, yeah. and it, it came out and you You're were a trucker. You're dating yourself on, a little bit I, there, well, Marshall. Yeah, <laughs> yeah sad right? but true. But yeah, you were a trucker. That was your, and so you played the board game, and that was That's your character. That's really cool. So, yeah. so you're gonna try to get that in for Marshall? Oh yeah, oh yeah. When he comes in, there you go. It. We'll have I'll it. I'll have it ready for All you. Right. That's awesome. Thanks, ah. Ashley. We appreciate it. You stumped the board game place. How do you do that? <laughs>